Welcome back everyone, today we have the Redmi Note 11 Pro Plus Just arrived at my place from China and I'm really excited to share this unboxing with you As you can see, um, this Redmi is really proud of it It's 120 watt fast charging speed And this is actually something very exciting because Up until recently you would need to spend 500 to 600 euros to get something that fast But now it is available for 300 euros So we get our SIM injection tool, some paperwork, and soft case. Let's have a look at this. You can see it is edgy as in the expected from the design. Here is our phone itself, let's leave it on the side for now. And of course the star of the show is the 120 watt fast charger. This is a really heavy brick, but we we know why. And if you order it in Europe, it comes with an adapter. I'm gonna include the link um, for the store I ordered from if you're interested. Let's open this up. USB A to USB C. Okay, let's have a look at the phone itself. So this is the green color and really understated and it kind of have a matte finish to it. Uh, let's remove the plastic to have a proper look at this. I believe the back is uh, kind of a frosted glass. Uh, we have the same 108 pixel we've got on the Redmi Note 10 um, Pro in the global version like earlier this year. So it's, um, Redmi is keeping this camera. I think it's the same HM2 Samsung sensor, side mounted fingerprint reader. And I think this is the most beautiful part of the design actually is the top. You get your 3.5 millimeter jack, IR blaster, uh, JBL branding and uh, speaker grill, another speaker grill at the bottom, USB-C port, and then this side is empty. Really beautiful design and you can see that it is probably a bit inspired of the iPhone 12 and iPhone 13 boxy shape uh, design. Let's have a look at the SIM card tray and then I'll set up the phone uh, so you can have a look at the screen, um, MIUI and also the charging experience. So you can see you have a rubber gasket around the um, tray and that's good for uh, waterproofing. I think it's IP53 rated, so splash, splash resistant and that's confirmed by this uh, rubber gasket. Here is your first SIM uh, slot and then your second SIM slot can also take an SD card, so that's great. So now I've set it up, let's have a look at um, screen, camera UI and um, do a loudspeaker test. Um, my first impression is that this uh, this screen is really bright and, and, and super crisp, uh, proper high grade um, AMOLED display. Let's have a look at the settings for it. The display can schedule dark mode. Uh, let's actually do that. Custom. Um, Refresh rate actually by default the 60 Hz, so let's set it up to 120. And then I like to um, enable reading mode actually. Classic, uh, remove a bit of the blue light. Um, while we're at it, let's also have a look at the specs of the device actually. Um, comes out with a uh, MIUI 12.53 out of the box. I think there is an also uh, update available. I can update that later. And um, storage is 19.6 gigabyte out of the box and available, uh, sorry, uh, occupied. 
Uh, of course, this is a 120 gigabyte model. Uh, if we look at the rest of the specs, this is the six gigabyte version, but you can also get it as an eight gigabyte model. And also it's running the, the new, brand new Dimensity 920, which has a maximum clock speed of 2.5. And I can notice that it's really uh, a very active uh, pr processor. Um, let's have a look at, of course, this is the China ROM, but it comes with English. So if you go to additional settings, um, language is set to English, and you can also install a uh, Google Play Store. Now let's look at the camera UI. Um, again, this is a 108 megapixel um, sensor available in the Redmi Note 10 Pro from earlier, last, uh, earlier this year, and it do a 9 to 1 pixel binning. So you can have, uh, you get your usual stuff, photo portray, and then I think in more you get your night mode and you get your 108 megapixel mode. Let's also see what kind of video resolution we get. If we click here, uh, you can get up to 40, 4K 30 FPS. Um, here's a quick photo sample I took now while setting up. Um, looks good in daylight. Of course, I'm going to test this more against other devices and let me know if you, in the comments if you want to. If you want me to say again, it's a specific device and I will do my best. And now let's do um, a loudspeaker test. There's a bit of distortion at the highest level, so I'm going to lower it a bit. To give you an idea of uh, loud speaker they're really loud and I think well well ba balanced from both sides okay now let's see the um, charging experience 120 watt fast charging so you actually get a special animation that indicates that this is 120 watts so not only me turbo and you can see that um, yeah it's already counting up this is our first look at the Redmi Note 11 Pro Plus. Hope you enjoyed this video and I'll see you in another one.